Hi guys! This morning we are going to do some leaf rubbing art. For this art project you will need some different leaves from your yard and then you will need some printer paper and you can either use crayons or colored pencils. Your choice. Let's get started. Here I have a leaf from a cherry tree. And here is a leaf from a Japanese maple tree and a sword fern. I grabbed a couple leaves from my Japanese maple tree. So you will take your first piece of paper and use that to arrange your leaves on. You don't have to do all of your leaves on the same paper, so I chose to keep my sword fern for a separate paper since it's a little big. Then you'll take your other piece of paper and set it right over the top of the bottom piece of paper. So you're sandwiching your leaves in between. Now you're going to take a crayon that you have removed the wrapper from, and you are going to rub it sideways over the leaves. Once you get the hang of it, you can go kind of fast. But make sure that you're holding the paper down with your other hand that you're not holding the crayon with. This will make sure that the leaves don't shift as you're shading over them. slowly you begin to see the leaf. try it with the sword fern. I'm going to take the leaves off of my piece of paper I used for the bottom and I'm just going to set the sword fern right on top. I'll need a fresh piece of paper for the top layer, but for the bottom layer you can use the same one you used the first time. I wanted to try this one more time with some different leaves and a different color crayon. discovered is that the sturdiest leaves seem to work the best. The clovers didn't work quite as well because they're pretty delicate and small. The sword fern made a really interesting design. If you have any in your yard, I would highly recommend using a fern for this project. 
hope you guys enjoyed this art project. You can try this with all different things, different leaves, different things from outside. You could even try it with quarters and pennies and all kinds of change. There's lots of cool designs on money. That might be a fun one to do. If you guys try this at home, I would love to see pictures. Have fun and have a wonderful day.